This technology is given to us. Do you know why? To test us. Are you going to get closer to Allah? Or are you going to be distracted? Distracted. There is something called TikTok. Have you heard of it? Do you know why they call it TikTok? Let me tell you. Time. What does time do? The second hand. Have you seen it? It moves. And you are just flicking tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Before you know it, your salah is gone, your another salah is gone, your day is gone, your night is gone, the next day is gone, your week is gone, your friends are gone, your iman is gone, everything is gone, your life will also go. And you wasted it on what? A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem. I am here in the house of Allah to tell you, it's okay to use technology. For as long as you know, you need to be in control. Look at good things. There are so many really beneficial things on TikTok. So much. You can learn a lot from Instagram, from Facebook, from all of you can learn so much but make sure you learn and make sure you don't abuse and make sure the time that you are on it is governed and controlled in a way that you don't miss your salah and you don't ignore your mother and father and you don't ignore your children and your brothers and sisters and you don't distance yourself from the quran and so on use technology it's very good it's important but control, be disciplined, and make sure you know how to use it. Because you will see a video of some imam saying something that does not make sense. And you think, let me believe it. Or oh, maybe this imam is not a good imam. Look, he's changing Islam. Yet that video can be made by someone who does not like him. And it can be fake. And it can be artificial intelligence and it can be a voice that is created that is similar to the voice of the person you know so you need to know how to use technology if you don't know how to use it do not use it because it will cheat you and deceive you